Hey everybody, it's Clint Eckern with Granite Ridge Realty. I want to talk about internet. Internet providers in Northwest Montana, specifically the Flathead Valley, a lot of questions I get is what are the internet speeds? What's up there and available? Um, is it good? Is it bad? So we're going to talk a little bit about that. But before we do that, I need to make a coffee. So let's do that real quick and I'll be right back. Good, that Keurig, that Keurig just hits good. All right, so Flathead Valley, internet, internet, Flathead Valley. So there are three major providers of internet in the Flathead Valley. They are Spectrum, Montana Sky, and Bullet. But Clint, you didn't mention CenturyLink. Well, there's a reason I didn't mention CenturyLink is because if at all possible, at all costs, they, the only reason that you should use CenturyLink is if they are your last resort and they are the only service that you can get to your home or business. But um, let's talk about the three major ones though, of course. So we got Spectrum. Spectrum is kind of your main broadband piece. If you're within city limits, you're probably using Spectrum. Um, they got pretty good speeds all the way up to a gig down, um, which for folks that uh, aren't sure what that means, it's really fast. So it's, it's pretty fast internet. The ping's good. Everything's looking solid on that side. Now the other two options, Montana Sky is kind of a hybrid. They offer wireless and they also are, offer over wire too and their speeds are really improving. Their wireless is impressive as well. Um, they're up to 50 down and 10 up on the wireless side. So Montana Sky is a great option. They run off of towers. If you're in the rural areas, it could be a great option for you. Um, and you just gotta call them up and see if your home or business pings to one of the towers that they're servicing uh, for their wireless internet. So that way you can ping off of their uh, their equipment there. And then um, the other one is Bullet Communications. I personally have Bullet Communications. They offer wireless as well, and I'm able to ping from my location in West Valley up to Lone Pine State Park. So for both of those wireless services, you wanna call them up, say, hey, here's my address. They're gonna say, I think we could probably hit that, but we're gonna send someone out there to make sure, and they'll, they'll run a test to make sure everything's good to go that way. Um, so those are really the three big providers. So let's talk about CenturyLink for a little bit. The reason that I don't recommend them at all for a first choice, the only time you're ever gonna use them is if they are the only option available to you at your location. And I mean, there it goes back to mainly customer service. There are times back when I was in the mortgage business that I kid you not, a buyer would buy a home, the home would transact, they would now be the new owner of a residence of a home right in Flathead Valley. They call CenturyLink because that's who serviced the home prior for internet. They call CenturyLink and CenturyLink would tell them, we no longer service that area. No joke, this happened multiple times to the point where it had to elevate to the state level in Helena um, just to address some of these. So uh, it, the customer service is poor, their infrastructure is poor, they just haven't updated it. Um, it's, it's last resort type of stuff. Um, sorry for any CenturyLink lovers out there though, because uh, my experience and people I know has been nothing but uh, just issues across the board. So now there's one more thing we want to talk about as well. So Starlink, some of you probably heard about, there are some people that I know personally in the Valley that are part of the beta platform for Starlink. Starlink is Elon Musk's internet provider company that if you've seen satellites roaming the skies and you're like, are those alien spaceships or what are those things? That is Starlink. Um, just satellites are being shipped up into space and eventually they'll be kind of blanketing this 360 piece around our globe, just satellites everywhere to make this full connectivity, wireless, anywhere you live in the world, all you need is the receiver and power to get it going on. So it's gonna be a game changer, but uh, just on the folks that I know in the Valley, the beta of it right now has just gotten stronger and stronger. There's still intermittent like breaks and signals, but supposedly in Flathead Valley, you're gonna be able to order this uh, Starlink setup probably by the end of this year or early next year, according to their website. But you're looking at speeds like right now of 150 to 200 download and like around 20 to 30 on the upload. So uh, for those that know what that's, that is, I mean, that's, that's, that's fast speeds and this is wireless. We're talking about 40 to 50 ping which is killer. So um, anyway, so there's are good options that are gonna satisfy the needs of folks that are 
way rural, way out there. Um, Starlink's gonna take care of that for you too. But really, recap it, we got Spectrum, Montana Sky, and Bullet Communications. Um, CenturyLink, very last resort. Um, I won't put that in the top three. And also, you're gonna have Starlink coming up here pretty soon to satisfy your out of the rural areas or even in rural that need a little bit of faster speed. So again, I'm Clint Eckern with Granite Ridge Realty. If you have any questions on buying or selling homes in the Flathead or Northwest Montana, just give me a call, love to chat. We'll catch you all later. Take care.